Hello, this is Trent Smith with the National Wind Service in Missoula, Montana, doing the briefing for Thursday, July 7th. Looking at the weather threat metrics, we are looking at uh, some more thunderstorms developing on Friday. Uh, a few of these could become quite strong across southwest Montana and west central during the afternoon and evening hours. And then we are anticipating a cold front moving through on Saturday, uh, bringing another round of showers and maybe a few thunderstorms uh, to the region. And then some lingering storms into Sunday. Uh, come Monday into Tuesday, we will start getting a ridge of high pressure building in, causing abnormally hot temperatures across the region. So as for those thunderstorms uh, for Friday, uh, the strongest storms, again, will be across southwest Montana, particularly Butte, Hamilton, Missoula, and come up into the Bob Marshalls. Uh, that's where we're anticipating the stronger storms, but uh, thunderstorms will be potentially developing anywhere in the forecast area, uh, but again, really concerned about southwest Montana and parts of west central. Here's a loop of what we're anticipating for thunderstorms to develop. We are expecting some thunderstorms to linger across the Missoula uh, area and maybe even across southwest during the overnight hours. Um, but things really get going by kind of late morning, early afternoon uh, around uh, Lost Trail Pass and up into southwest. Parameters right now are indicating that the storms could be a little bit stronger than what we've seen across the area on Wednesday and Thursday. Uh, so a little bit better chance of some severe storms uh, causing gusty winds, uh, large hail, but a uh, concern is also a uh, very heavy rain uh, associated with these. I'll let this uh, kind of run through a couple of times so you can see the progression of the uh, shower activity and thunderstorm development. We are anticipating a cold front moving through the area, cooling temperatures to uh, below normal readings for this time of year. Uh, probably the biggest indication is just a slight increase in westerly winds. Uh, the ridges across the region could see gusts up to 30 miles per hour. And again, as I stated earlier, the potential of a few showers, maybe even a thunderstorm with that cold front and some lingering uh, thunderstorms across southwest Montana. Uh, on Sunday. And as you can see with the temperature trend, uh, we are looking at that ridge of high pressure uh, moving over the area. Uh, with some of the warmest temperatures we've experienced so far this season, it looks like uh, north central Idaho should peak out with their highest temperature being on Tuesday, uh, while uh, western Montana uh, highest temperatures will probably be on that Wednesday uh, time frame. Um, but that ridge should be fairly short-lived. Um, models are indicating that we'll move back into that southwest flow, um, kind of that uh, by the weekend. That will be indicative of a few showers and thunderstorms, again, developing across portions of north central Idaho into southwest Montana. Uh, but temperatures will continue to be above normal for this time of year. Uh, so warm temperatures, but uh, an increase in shower activity by uh, next weekend after that ridge of high pressure. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to the office uh, with the number on the screen. Uh, if not, the next briefing is anticipated for Sunday, July 10th. Thank you.